In this video, we are going to demonstrate the assessment of the fifth cranial nerve, namely the trigeminal nerve. Enroll in our online course now. Link is in the video description. Hi and welcome back to PhysioTutors. The trigeminal nerve's sensory nucleus has three branches. The ophthalmic division, innervating the skin of the forehead and the cornea and conjunctiva, the maxillary division innervating the skin in the middle of the face, and the mandibular division supplying sensory innervation to the skin of the lower jaw and motor fibers to the muscles of mastication, namely the temporalis, masseter and pterygoids. No diagnostic accuracy studies are available, so the clinical value is unknown. To test the sensory innervation, a cotton wool ball and blunt pin are used. The patient is asked to close their eyes. Then the cotton ball and pin sequentially touch the forehead, the malar eminence and the lower face over the mandible. The patient is asked to state when they feel the touch and whether they feel a sharp or dull sensation. Both sides are compared. Dull, sharp, dull, dull, sharp, dull, sharp. Sharp, dull, sharp, sharp, dull. Another item to test is the corneal reflex. Stand to the side of the patient and depress the patient's eyelid. Ask the patient to gaze into the distance. Then, using a wisp of cotton, touch the cornea gently. Observe for a blinking reflex in both eyes and ask the patient if they felt the touch. To test the motor function of the mandibular division, ask the patient to clench the jaw while you palpate for muscle tone and muscle bulk. You can also ask the patient to hold the mouth open while you try to force it shut with your hand. At last, examine for an exaggerated jaw reflex. With the mouth slightly opened, place one index finger on the chin and tap it with a reflex hammer. Normally, you would observe slight closure or no reflex at all. Alright, you can check out other cranial nerve assessments in the playlist on the left. If you want more videos like this one, make sure to subscribe to our channel and leave a comment down below. Also, if you didn't know yet, we have an extensive assessment ebook, mobile app for Android and iOS, and a standalone online course that you can find in the video description right below the like button. As always, this was Andreas for PhysioTutors. I'll see you in another video. Bye.